to Geek's Corner, I'm Mr. Daps. And I'm Johnny Five. And I'm Hallie again. Yes. Welcome back. It's so good. You know, so very excited about that. I'm incredibly excited. You oh. came back. That's <laughs> the first time a girl's ever come back to this studio. <laughs> is, this the, is this the first time that we've had the same guest star two shows in a row? Yeah. Okay, so you, you are the first, like, consistent. Mm hmm I think, yeah, that's, that's, especially, a, big that's a big thing. Especially Woo! for a show called Geek's Corner, to exactly. have a girl come back, yes. that's a huge deal. To, to not only watch the show, but then to find out what it actually is to be a part of it, and still come back, so, welcome. You're welcome. You clearly didn't look at the comments from last week, huh? <laughs> <laughs> so, tonight, tonight, what are we covering? Tonight, we are covering movies, as you may be able to tell from the background, which our studio audience doesn't so necessarily nice. know what you're looking at, but <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was so beautiful. It, it does, so serene. What a sunny day. And when we decide what it is, no, it's, the, it's a Hollywood sign. Uh, so we're going to be talking about movies. This mm -hmm. is the movie edition of Geek's Corner. Specifically and, uh, genres of movies. Yes. I like, I like genre as opposed to genre, because it oh, sounds more like Johnny that. Five. Genre. <laughs> John, genre Five. Which we are talking about five genres, and that's why I'm five today. You didn't ask, but I will tell you anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of asking. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe you can ask him why he's Johnny Five. Hey, Johnny Five! Are you delegating? Yeah. Wow. No, I, I already answered. What? Come up with another one. <laughs> Come up with another one. So first, first genre. Yes. Involves instruments. Like it does. Because we like westerns. What's your favorite western? My favorite western. Um, I don't know that I have a favorite, but I was watching Hondo recently, and that was uh, very entertaining. It's a well-known one. It's got John Wayne. What are you talking about? Come on. Like Silverado. Okay. How about you? Have you ever seen a western? I have. Okay. Um, <laughs> 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 I, I saw I saw a lot of them actually, okay, and okay. I don't remember what the one I liked was called. So. Do you remember Since what happened? Since you're so proficient on westerns. I am really, really well versed in westerns. Yeah. And we're gonna throw you on the spot right now. We told you just like two minutes ago. Yep. You're gonna sing a solo tonight because everybody wanted you to last week. So um, we're gonna sing a western improv solo. Mm -hmm. They're going to be so disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> no, Set the expectations this. low and they will be exceeded. It's not even singing. Okay. Here we go. It's singing. It's beautiful. Ready? Go for it. All right. Westerns. Hot cowboys. <laughs> Guns. <laughs> For a, a shorty. Yes, yes. Which, which we had to look up what it was. But, uh, <laughs> so I'm really short. So yes, yeah. We got that? we got a shorty and we were nominated for a shorty. And so that's pretty cool. And people can vote they can, for us. They can vote via Twitter, I think. Yeah, at the Geeks Corner. Platform. Yeah, is, is so. our Twitter handle. But we also think it'd be really awesome if you were to nominate and vote for DoCheckOutMySite.com to give them some 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 love too. Because mm -hmm. because uh, we are anything. harmonious now. We we yeah. don't have a war anymore. We have we have made made peace. peace. Yes, we have. Yes, we are blood brothers. 
or something. Okay, well, We're on the we'll Western theme still. Though. Okay, blood siblings. Okay. We don't really know who runs it. Okay, yeah. well, you're my like second cousins twice from Christmas. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Again, it's good, it's good. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah. so we hope this warms up your snowy night wherever you are. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, so go nominate them and, and vote for them yeah. for whatever you can vote for them for. And I don't know the name of the web or the address of the well, website. We'll put it in the in the description. Sure, okay, we'll do that. That'll be great. Mm -hmm. so. so next genre, sci-fi. Ah, sci-fi. Can't go wrong with sci-fi. Well, <laughs> you kind of can. You kind of can, and I think we have a way to show that. I right? think so too. Uh, so we'll just run that. We have a new segment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's, it, let's it. run it. interested in the future, for that is where you and I are going to spend the rest of our lives. And remember, my friend, future events such as these will affect you in the future. You are interested in the unknown, the mysterious, the unexplainable. That is why you are here. We now present to you the first installation of our new segment, Great Sci-Fi Moments with Mr. Dabbs. Over. You got me that time, Mac. This American Flight 812 requesting. Burbank Tower to American Flight 812. Over. Burbank Tower to American Flight 812. Over. Holy mackerel. Burbank Tower to American Flight 812. Are you in trouble? Trouble? Take a look for yourself. That's nothing from this world. Burbank Tower to American Flight 812. Are you in trouble? Are you in trouble? Mayday, Mayday. Stand by, Burbank Tower. You suppose a passenger saw it? I doubt it. Most of them are asleep. But it was quite a jolt, Jeff. I'll check. Good. We'll get it ready for landing. And keep it quiet until we get instructions. Right. OK, Danny. American Flight 812, reporting to Burbank Tower. Over. Post it in the comments. I want to see if anybody recognizes where this is. Studio audience is not. We will be really eligible. impressed if you've ever seen this before. Yeah. yeah. If you recognize it at all, that'd be really cool. Because I never. They don't know you. No. They have no idea. So <laughs> sequels, we're going to count as the next genre. Sequels. Yes. Oh, I didn't know it was a genre. We're counting it. It kind of is. Just because there's too many genres to and, put in. A and show. really, there is an art to the sequel. There, there's a definite style. You know, of taking a film and saying what happens next. So I, I think it counts as a. Do you have a favorite? A favorite sequel. Mm -hmm. um, I, I actually really enjoyed Toy Story Two. Oh, that's mm -hmm. actually a good one. I mean, everyone everyone's thinking of Toy Story Three right now or the original, but Toy Story Two is really. What do you think is the best sequel? I don't know. Anybody can shout it out. I can't think, think of any smart. sequels that I thought were better than the first one. Back to the Future Two. Um, Empire Strikes Back. Whoa. See, we have like, <laughs> two right there. <laughs> Wow, our audience came up with really geeky answers. How, what a coinky Appropriate. Thank you. Thank you, audience. 
Yeah, but, and we're sequel. Mm. Oh, I think Jaws. <laughs> 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 Bigger Jaws. Caddyshack um, 2. <laughs> Ghostbusters well, 2. Sure, sure. Groundhog's Day 2. It was the same movie as Groundhog's Day 1. I swear, they didn't change a line. <laughs> I'm kidding. I know. <laughs> you, know, you, know sequel, you know what sequel really upset me? Was Ocean's 10, because they jumped straight to 10 without doing like 1 through 9. So I don't know all the backstory of everything that happened. So I feel really weird jumping in at 10. Somebody like, Yeah! Like, right? Are you incensed by this? I'm incensed. Let's personally. make all 9. Let's make all 9. I will be right back. I have some movies. <laughs> so is that the sequel you'd like to see? Is one through nine? I guess that's the sequel. Those, those are prequels. Do you have any that you'd like to see? Uh, well, I don't know. Last week we talked about Romeo and Juliet. Do you, you really know? want to see I, a sequel to that? I want to know what happens to the tractor. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like the uh, the lawn version of. Uh, of the Scottish play. I was going to say it, but I realized we are actually in a studio with things hanging above our heads. That might not be a good idea. Uh, <laughs> There's nothing above me. <laughs> Move just sorry that way. Uh-huh. <laughs> Perfect. So, mm -hmm. that would be interesting, I think. Yeah. You have to pick another Shakespeare play to make into a line. Yeah, I, I, I just don't want to die. Next. Genre, please. Next genre. Moving on. We're moving on, and we're calling these this the epic genre. Yeah. 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 We're calling it weird epic. genres. Well, we were looking There's online, so and there was like such bleed fifty different genres, and they count war, and they count. But you start crime. with like a classic, like western, and then you go like. Psh. Yeah, well, we always go downhill. <laughs> oh, okay. <Yeah. laughs> you start at the top, and now then. Now that I'm yeah. aware. All right. Yeah, you bring people <laughs> in at the beginning, and they can pause or whatever and walk away and get a sandwich. Are you eating a sandwich right now? Comments. <laughs> what kind? Yeah, so, um, Bellhop Murray did a wonderful segment for us, and we'll let that run. Hi, I'm Murray the Bellhop. I happen to be half Japanese and half American, and so I'm able to tell you anything I want to with uh, great expertise. And so, with that, I would like to submit to you the best movie plot ever. It would feature a young American boy who grows up playing StarCraft and wants to become the best StarCraft player ever. But the best StarCraft players are not in America, they're in Korea. Which Korea, I'm not really sure actually, but uh, he has to travel to the land of the Koreans to become the best StarCraft player ever. Well, because he's American, he faces great adversity. And so he must train to become the best StarCraft player ever through great challenges. Well, will he become the best StarCraft player? Will he find true love? Will his dog survive? You will have to watch the movie and find out. Thank you. I don't know what that was. <laughs> It's still j the land of the Koreans. <laughs> Welcome to the land of the Koreans. It's like how... It just feels like we should be on a cruise. Right? It's the love boat, exciting and new. No? <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, I'm going into TV. We're doing movies. Yeah. I, I will save that. So did you like his pitch? Uh, I, don't, I don't think I'm going to watch it. Do you know what StarCraft is? Actually... You don't play StarCraft? I, I don't. Have you ever heard of StarCraft? Yes. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> good. good. That's the one with the little fox and the turtle and the starships in there. Yeah, that's definitely what I'm um, talking about. <laughs> so, how is that words of wisdom? I don't just. We're, we're really batting a thousand with, with segment names this week, I think, okay. actually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. we'll, we'll, maybe we'll moving right rename along. that. Yeah, mm -hmm. moving, moving along. So, so, action and adventure. Is that Action and adventure. That's, a, that's an acceptable okay. genre. Okay. Thank you. Jean. Um, in this Hello, my name is Jean Ron. <laughs> Picard. Um, so for this, we thought we would do a Mad Libs, and we thought we would pick the ultimate action adventure movie ever. Do you remember what it is? Do you want me to remind you? Yes, please. <laughs> the Care Bear movie. Yes! <laughs> ultimate action adventure yes! film. So we're doing a Mad Lib, so I need to know an animal. Fox. Thanks. Anam. Tree. 
Another noun. Pineapple. <laughs> <laughs> one syllable, Fox. Oh, are you Plural pineapple? noun. Bicycles. Is it dick? He's on a bit. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Occupation. Dentist. <laughs> Verb ending in ing. Ready? Flying. Adjective. Slimy. Yeah. Noun. Gross. That's an adjective. Uh, yeah. it's an adjective. It's a what would you say? It's an adjective. Penguin. Oh, penguin. Oh, I like that one. Penguin is an adjective? No. It's an adjective. No, but I need an adjective now. You do? Uh -huh. Gross. <laughs> a plural noun. Fives. <laughs> Verb ending in ed. Wash. Lived. Ooh. Lived. 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 Adjective. Epically. Squeaky. Epically is an adverb. Sorry. Ooh. No, it's true. Adverb. Epically. <laughs> <laughs> and last but not least, a plural noun. Hobbits. Balloons. Balloons. Hobbit Sorry. balloons. <laughs> <laughs> Ever the diplomat. <laughs> Here you go. You ready? Okay. I hope this is better than the last one. Me too. <laughs> that was bad. You ready? Really? Okay. The care fox lived in a tree high in the clouds, where they have a lot of fun together. But they also do care for the pineapple children on Earth, <laughs> who they watch through huge bicycles from the sky, and come to help wherever there is need. Nicholas, a dentist's apprentice, is in danger of chasing under the influence of a slimy penguin, <laughs> which resides in a gross spell book. <laughs> the siblings, Kim and Jason, don't trust fives anymore. <laughs> After being lived once too often, the care fox take them into their wonderland, <laughs> where they experience exciting and squeaky adventures together, <laughs> and epically become good hobbit balloons. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can you say hobbit? Was hobbit already in there? No, we said Hobbit balloons. Oh, oh, we had the diplomat oh, oh, over oh, in the corner oh, right, that, right. that knew how to resolve <laughs> the, the few. Uh, I'm not sure that that would work out so well, actually. We're, we're not doing so well with the magic. A dentist's right? apprentice? <laughs> <laughs> I think that should be a movie. <laughs> with uh, Shia LaBeouf. With <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. I know it wasn't Shia LaBeouf in the thing, but I can't think of what the guy's name was. Jay Burchell. Who? Huh? Jay Burchell. There we go. See? And uh, Alfred Molina. Can't be any worse. Um, <laughs> yeah, one more. We have one more. We do? Yeah. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. You positive? Yeah. Are you ready for this? No. Because we felt that we had to put in romantic comedy. Somebody commented on Twitter or something that uh, if they could go geeky, we could talk about romantic comedy. So here you go. We will talk about it. Um, yeah. But we, uh, nothing yeah. Really, really romantic happens in Dap Studios. Mm -mm. So. Uh, or it didn't. <laughs> you were you were telling me about something when we met a few weeks ago. Yeah. Well, you know, I was okay. okay. So I was here. I was at the DAP studio. And this one or the one? This hey. one, right oh, here. Oh, this one. Okay. Right, right here. Okay. Right. And I was waiting for you. But mm -hmm. I don't know where you were. I was probably in the other one. In the, oh, okay. Well, nobody told it, me where it to happens go. It's a lot. It's warmer. So I was here, and then this guy came up to me, and he was all. Hey, you're really pretty. And I was like, um, thanks. <laughs> and he was like, yeah. And I was like, okay. And he was like, yeah. <laughs> I'm a little bit worried about this. Yeah. Uh huh. I told you. I don't. I mean. Yeah. This this isn't so good. It's not. Did he work here? Um, you know, I'm not really sure. Oh, what he was just, like? He just he just was like staring at me. Did so he have slicked back hair? He might. He, had, uh, he might he have. tall suit. Yeah, you know, I mean, I like, I like short guys, it's, it's okay, you know, but... Okay. Not, you know, <laughs> anyway. Okay. <laughs> so, so then what happened? I don't, yeah. I think you should make me not tell the story, actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for, that's just not, let's stop. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So you don't like penguins? I don't, I don't. No, not anymore. Oh, <laughs> I know this story. You do like, oh, what happened, Johnny? Uh, I, because you know that the Dab Studios has security cameras set up, so they record... John just got really creepy, didn't he? Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, but in the in the kitchen there was a there was a conversation between you and uh, and the penguin intern. I don't recall such. You don't. No. You that don't definitely recall? didn't happen. Can can we roll a tape? You want to roll a tape? Do no. we? 
I don't know what tape you're talking about, but go ahead. Let's, let's roll it then. So that is uh, that's something from from the studio. That, that okay. so wonderfully. Yeah. yeah. That was a reenactment by actors. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that was you. It looked just like you. Really comments. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's all the time we have for tonight. I think so. See you around the corner. Geek out.